So hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Um, and we have another video here. Ang ating problem naman ay ratio problems. So, tinuruan ko kayo sa word analogy kung paano basahin ito. So ito, um, ang pagbasa din naman ito is 3 is to 5 as 12 is to blank. So 3 is to 5, 15, sorry. 3 is to 15 as 12 is to blank. So, paano ba sinosolve ito? So, meron dalawang methods actually kung paano isosolve ito siya. So, yung cross multiplication at yung ratio rotation or yung rotation method. So, start muna tayo sa tinatawag nating cross multiplication. So, paano ba sinusulat ito? Uh, para mag igawin natin siyang fraction form. So, pwede siya kasing 3 is to 5, pwede siyang i-express as ganyan is equal to 12 is to blank. So, 12 is to x. So, x or ano natin. Pwede nyo gamitin a, b, n, ganun. Pwede, basta malaman na natin na um, unknown siya. So, uh, dapat, magkatapat yung magkatapat yung kung saan siya pa pareho. Bawa kung nasa left side siya ng colon, eto, yung colon natin. Ayan. So, kung nasa left side siya ng colon, nasa taas siya, yung right side ng colon nasa baba. So, since unknown siya, ayan. So, magkatapat yung 3 at 12, 15. Ito, 3, 12, 15, tsaka unknown. So, dapat magkatapat siya. So, uh, very simple, i-cross multiply lang. 3 times x is 3x, since it's an equation. And, uh, 15 times 12 is equal to so since wala nga calculator sa tawag nito civil service kailangan natin siyang mano mano so 15 times 12 then 1 times 2 2 3 5 2 ah bobo <laughs> sorry guys okay 15 times 12, 5 times 2, 10, carry 1, 1 times 2, 2 plus 1, 3, 5 times 1, 5, 1 times 1, 1. So, 0, 180. So, magiging 180 siya. Now, divide both sides by 3. Para makansal yan, x is equal to 60, 6, 12, 18. Okay. So, 60 yung unknown natin. So, medyo tedious siya, tsaka medyo mahirap. So, to, uh, how about yung sinasabi ko kaninang uh, ratio rotation? So, ito naman siya. Ito din ang form niya. So, magiging, dito na lang ako susulat. 3 over 15 is equal to 12 over x. So, ito siya. Uh, magsa-start ka sa pinakamalaking number. And then, magro-rotate kang pa ganyan. Away from the, tawag nito, away from the unknown. Ayan. So, magro-rotate kang ganyan. So, ang rotation natin, meron tayong sinusunod na, meron tayong sinusunod na parang pattern. So, na operation. So, 15 divided by 3 times 12. So, divide muna siya, dyan. And then, magmumultiply siya dyan. So, 15 divided by 3 is 5. 5 times 12 is equal to 60. So, x is equal to 60. So, pareho lang naman siya sa uh, cross multiplication method natin at sa rotation method natin. So, which is which? Uh, depende pa rin sa inyo. Um, ang ano lang naman natin dito eh, sa civil service exam naman eh, kailangan lang natin ng um, pinakamadaling pagkuha ng sagot sa pinakamabilis na paraan pero pinaka-accurate na pagkakuha ng answer. So, depende kung saan kayo comfortable, um, pwede nyo gamitin itong cross multiplication method or itong ratio rotation method. So, again guys, pa, pag depende pa rin sa inyo yung gusto nyong maging method ng ating pagkuha ng ratio, ng ating solution sa ratio problem. So, 12 is to 60. So, that's it guys. Kung meron kayong other request videos, pwede nyong ilagay sa comment or you can directly message me through Instagram at Larry Elite. Thank you very much.